Well, hello there. Welcome to another Black Ops 3 Custom Zombies map. This is Lethal Company Zombies. And uh, kind of themed with the last map I just played. This one I've already played before, but I had technical difficulties and issues that caused the recordings to break or gameplay to get broken and I couldn't finish the map or couldn't finish the recording. So I'm trying this again for like, I don't think it's like the fourth time after taking a little break so i kind of know where things are kind of know what's going on and i'm just gonna play it anyways play it for you guys so anyways joy this is going to be a probably unedited video just because i don't like spending a ton of time if nobody's watching these videos so you know anyways i've got 1500 points but i think i need to open this door yep couldn't remember i had a doubt for a second because it's been a day or two since I last tried to play this and record it, and it, you know, issues arose. Whether it's skill issues, or my computer said nope, or the power said nope, or interruptions for important reasons, and I had to like stop recording. Anyways, this is a really dark map. It's really confusing because there's like a bajillion doors and a not a whole lot of like guns and stuff. And I vaguely remember power and jug and speed cola. And then I know what the ending is, where it is, how to get to it. But I'm probably still going to die because this map is, is one of those that is very difficult because the learning curve is very real. And no, I am not buying quick revive because ultimately that's just wasting my time. If I go down and I'm like a million miles out in the middle of BFE on this map. <laughs> Also, I don't know why this... Oh, I know what's going on. I know what's going on. I know why I can't hear the zombies. I will fix that just momentarily once I end this round. And I will edit it out because I had to adjust my volume for a previous map I just played. Okay, there should be zombie sounds now. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, I had to turn it down for another map because uh, their copyrighted music was on the voice track apparently which is also the same one that uh, controls how loud zombies are which I always have that cranked up because I like to hear when they're coming up behind me and not beating me and to the ground from behind because I can't hear them all right zombies Ooh, luckily I spawned out this uh, RK7 and it's right off the wall so I have ammo for a gun that's actually not too bad this is weird because Black Ops 4 guns are notoriously garbage. At least in my book they are. Most of them are pretty garbage unless it's on custom maps where they tune the weapons properly to uh, kill zombies effectively. And also double taps a thing in this game so you know. <laughs> um, I'm out of ammo. I about that. I need to go back and um, buy that GKS off the wall too. I just remembered that. Because that's a pretty decent weapon for this map. And considering the fact that there's very few weapons anyways, uh, yeah. Alright, zombies. You know what? I just remembered something, and I'm an idiot. I don't think I needed to open this door, actually. That's the fun part about this map, and when I say fun, I mean the really annoying, painful part about it is, is all the rooms and doors interconnect so much that to get to, like, power, there's, like, 10,000 different ways to do it. But once you open the door, you can't close them, obviously. So, yeah, that's fun. Also, which I'm surprised I didn't get one of these yet, there... I stand there for a second. There are napalm zombies as well, which is not fun. Grab that. Let's go back to the ship. Uh, give me that. Thank you. Wait, what's that? Okay, I, I don't know what that does for sure, but I'm turning it on anyways. I, I knew there was something else I needed to activate while I was in there, and I forgot about that. But anyways. I think I should have actually opened that door. Because I think it's a straight shot to power if I do. When I say a straight shot, I mean it's like the shortest amount of doors to open. Why am I getting pushed in here? What the heck? It's so weird. 
That'll be nice. Go away, Flamer! Alright. Taking a gamble here. Please don't uh, screw with me over. Also, I need to remember there's scrap I need to collect, which is in random spots. Just random items, I should say. One's on me left. Alright. Good. Perfect. I did not screw up by killing that flame. That wasn't there before. Wait a minute. This dude update the map and actually make it easy. If he did, I'm going to be so mad. Because I struggled the first time I played this. Because I was so far from power. And I never did find where power was the first time I played. It took the second time around. And then, you know. Then the actual power in real life decided to uh, fail. And then when I tried it again, I had an emergency which required me to stop playing, and you know, I just essentially gave up after that point. I was like, you know what, this map's cursed. <laughs> this place is cursed. Alright. Oh. He took a door out, too, apparently. Because there used to be a door right there, which I guess that opens all at the same time now? Oh no, you know. I don't know if I glitched it or something. Um... More scrap. Ah, uh, zombie. So yeah, I gotta go around and collect all this scrap to actually unlock the ending, but also in the process of doing so, I, uh, I gain points, which is really nice. I need another set of points to buy this. Which, this is a clutch perk on this map, because you're about to see why, as long as you didn't nerf it. Aha, see, you can see where the perks are now, which is awesome. Uh, any more scrap? Probably not in here, though. Wait, shield part. Nice. Okay, so he highlights the shield parts now, too. Do-do-do-do. So, yeah, unfortunately, it's not like a learning experience on video, but my previous recordings are so messed up or broken because of reasons uh, I just didn't want to fight with editing them to uh, make any sense out of it. All right. Nothing in here. The fun part is, is the scrap is not highlighted, so you know, it's still got a learning curve on where all the locations are. I think they're fixed, but I, don't know. I haven't confirmed that yet. I know sometimes it seemed like I grabbed the scrap before and it was still there, and then the next time it seemed like, okay, it should be here, but it's not, so. Do -do -do. Gotta love running around in super dark, foggy maps, too. It's great for viewing purposes. Alright, some more scrap. I don't have enough points to do anything. But actually, I think. Open that door and I go. to the left? Or the right? Oh, cool. But it's wine. You know, jug or speed cola would have been really, really useful. As I casually just mag dump the floor for no reason. Alright, um, dude. So basically, what I want to do, or I need to do, is get my perks and get Pack a Punch. And then I need to save up 50,000 because while the ending is not unlocked yet, I need the points beforehand because if I don't, I get SOL'd. <laughs> Or unless he has changed that, and that won't be so S-O-L-E. Or I'll just get completely screwed still. It definitely seems like he's toned the zombies down too. They were a little bit more angry the first time. The first few times I played this. It has been a few days, or actually it's been a... Actually it's been over a week since I played this initially. When it first came out, like literally, it was like minutes after it just came out. I actually managed to catch the map. I was like, oh, cool, I'm gonna play this one. Uh, I might actually buy this cordite. That would be a good point. Later. Do you detonate now, buddy? No, you don't. So go away. Sometimes those flamers do go off if you get near them, and sometimes they don't. It's one of those maps that they don't, apparently, you know? 
So if I remember, I think Speed Cola is there. Jug is over there somewhere. Uh, zombies spawn right here. I forgot about that. Another stay slow and away from me perk. Or power up. Death machine? Nah. Ten zombies left. Okay, that's not cool. Five left, alright. I think we can make never mind, I can't make crawlers, because you know what is one. Best perk in the game. Not always, people, not always. Alright, um I remember how to get speed cola. Actually I do, and I think I know why I opened the uh the quick revive door now. It's almost a straight shot from here, so I gotta go open that door, and then not that door. Bye, zombie. Thanks for uh, just ending your existence for me. There it is. Almost a straight shot. Dogs. Grab a quick revive. Or not quick revive. Speed cola. Speed call. I don't know why I said quick revive. I think it's because another map I just played a little bit ago. Names perks funny, and I'm not giving them away. Why? Wow. Cool. Couldn't shoot him, and then he just teleports through the wall or the stairs. Go away, flamey dude. Warning you. Oh, a nuke. If only I could get through that without dying. Almost died. <laughs> Almost. Oh gosh, I don't remember how to get a jug. Um, I don't remember how to get the jug. Not good. Now I don't know where I'm going to stand at because of uh, zombies, you know. Wow, okay. Why are they tanking bullets, like, badly? Oh, nope, never mind, never mind. Go away, zombies! Is that a perk? Oh my gosh, they just come in such clutch. Oh no, I, I chased poorly again. Right, you're not going to detonate, but you do hit me? Weird. Alright, no, I don't have to worry about Jug, so uh, double tap, please. That would be a nice necessity. I need to get more scrap as well so I can actually unlock the ending. So is it not behind that door? So I'm at 800 out of 1500. You know what? I'll we'll just chill here for a second. That'll definitely help. Can you stop doing that. That's annoying, zombies. All right. Oh, knife lunge about threw me away. Right. Perfect! Frozen place and blocking zombies. Grab that. Make a big difference. Uh, okay, there's not a door here, but there is scrap. I thought there was a door there. Thanks. 
random can of soda is points, apparently. Any more scrap around here? I don't think so. Infinite ammo? Um, I don't think I need it. Oh, cool, you all are jammed up. Does that make a crawler? Oh, it does. Good, a guy needs to go away. Um, alright. Stamina up over here? Do you believe so? I don't know if that perk will actually help. But there is a gun here. I'll turn that off. Flashlight, regular one, please. Thank you. Okay. Scrap. Oh, there we go. Now comes the great scrap hunt for undetermined items of questionable value. Oh, man. Ah, yes. There's those also, which is nice. I have not been collecting shield parts. Oops. Well, I have, but I haven't got them all yet. Alright. Do that. Alright, I'm trying to remember where there's actually useful doors I need to open at. There's none there. There's a shield part down below me. Actually... Hmm. I, I better buy them while I can. More scrap and more items in here I can collect for money. Don't believe so. Go this way. Look around in this other area real quick. So I did open. Okay. Probably check that. About down here. Check that. <laughs> the fish is worth something apparently. Mystery gun that does not appear unless it's on the other side of the wall. No, it can be. That's right. I think that's a rune that's like got a big pit in it. Wait, there's a gun here. Oh, it's a Mog 12. Why did I not notice that before? That's weird. Uh, more Wonderfizz location. Nothing at all there. All right. Uh, oh, there's something. So let's see. Um, I don't remember what happens if I open that door? Oh, a whole lot of nothing, I guess. Apparently, a gun behind that door or wall. All right. Well, what's here? Uh, nothing. Yes. Perfect. Just wasted all my time and money on that. You know what? Go away, zombie. I probably chose suicide here, but whatever. Yep, because... Of course, why would they not spawn in that corner? Be really lucky if it uh, only spawned up there, but I doubt it. The odds are not in my favor in this map, I can tell you that much. The map is very difficult. But luckily with Vulture Aid, you do get that kind of invisibility for the moment. Although, I, I feel like I should do that real quick, just for safety. So look at all of them! That's more than 15 zombies, game. Oh, he's a headless crawler. Oops. Um. Okay, they're stuck. That's good, sir. Tombstone? Ah. Whoa. Game. Chill. I'm trying to go prone. Wait, collect scrap. I'll take it. More scrap. Nice. What do we got here? Tommy gun. Ooh. Almost makes me want to go back and buy Mule Kick. Wait, have I found Mule Kick yet? 
Oh no, it's way over there. It's behind this door. Another staircase. More scrap. Okay, that's just the one back quickly. Oh. Uh, this is bad, this is bad. What's behind this door? Oh no, it's all kinds of bad now. More bad than I want. Um. Oh no. Go away. <laughs> Alright, maybe I should just go pack a bunch. Maybe that'd be the better investment right now. Ow, I'm still getting hurt. Maybe pack a bunch would be the better investment. If I can get back to pack a bunch of those. Uh, wait, scrap. Oh, nice. Only maybe three more pieces? Scrap? And I should have the quota and then I can go unlock the ending, which is... I'm not spoiling it because truth be told, the first time I did unlock it, I... Uh, I about died instantly. <laughs> Just put it that way. Oh boy, zombies are everywhere. Zombies are everywhere. I think I need stamina. I feel slow. It's probably a bad idea, honestly. Yep, not not the greatest idea. Oh, that'll be nice. Alright. Pack punch that. Honestly, you should just pack punch that too. I have enough, might as well. Alright, so. Oh, run away. Run away. Um. So where was a good spot for me to stand at and just shoot zombies? So that's the emergency exit. They sp pretty sure they spawn here. Oh, free park. Elemental. Well, that'll be maybe helpful. I don't know. I do need more scrap, though, so I, I need to open areas, I believe. Or look... A little bit more. Probably missed some stuff along the way. Wait, is that something? Ah, it is. Oh, that was worth a hundred. Nice. Okay, so maybe I don't need so much scrap. Well, at least one more, I guess. And then fifty thousand, and bang, game over. Hopefully, we'll actually beat the map without something horrible happening that is completely out of my control. <laughs> And mostly not in game either. Go away, Flamey. Nobody likes you. That will actually help. Shoot you zombies. How many left? Five. Three of you jammed in the doorway, really. Can I make a crawl? Yes, I can. Nice. Alright, that was beautifully executed. Sort of. Alright, um... I don't remember where some of these stores are. I think I know where these doors here lead to. Um, some of these doors I don't actually have to open because they are repetitive. They just get me access to areas I've already have gotten to. Um, I'll go back this way. Ah, oh, I know where I can open, I think. Was this a door? Okay. Um, oh, ding! Alright, so that's done. Okay, yeah, this is another way I can go. Back to the ship. Honestly, it might be good to stay here because 
There's a gun off the wall. So, nothing there. What's behind this door? No. Do I really need to open any more doors? Or should I just go ahead and get my 50,000? Ending is unlocked. Yeah, let's just go ahead and go for 50,000. I need points. I need lots and lots of points. For zombies not to do that. Oh no, they're not going away. The vulture aid is failing me. I got turn. Oh, okay. okay. I thought a flamer was spawning under my crotch. It's just a uh, blast furnace going off. To destroy zombies. <laughs> All right, that's done with. So, what is this gun's swordfish? I don't remember what that gun is for sure. Hopefully, it's not something dumb though. If I upgraded it like bad. Ow! What the heck's hitting me? Must be that gas. Yeah, that gas does damage to me. That's interesting. Honestly, I don't know if I should get electric cherry or not. Wait. Oh, more scrap. Oh, that's right. You can get more than the, the limit because apparently, I guess there's a bonus if you get the 2,000, I think, or 2,500, or 3,000, maybe. I don't remember. It tells you at the beginning on a little piece of paper. I don't know if this electric cherry is going to help much. Hopefully it does. Just need 50,000 points, Zombas. Deadshot, too. Hit fire accuracy improved a little bit. Alright. Where are the rest of these? Y'all taking the long way around? Like, jeez. Apparently. Um, got the swordfish. Oh, SDM. Now, that's a killing weapon, but it's not a point-building weapon. Hmm. I think the SDM was honestly, like, the best gun in Black Ops War Zombies. Super overpowered, and you can get a ton of ammo in it. At least from what I remember. I know it was a sniper rifle, but... In that game, the points worked weird, so it was, like, points by kills, not by bullets fired. Ultra Aid, save me! Man, that turn guy is uh, wrecking him. Hey! Zombies! You don't know I'm here, remember? Ultra Aid! Apparently. I'm almost out of ammo in this gun. It's not good. Is there anything else? Oh. Points. Take that. Any scrap in here? I could... Another fish. More points. Do, 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 do. Giant oversized electrical outlets. That'd be worth some money, right? <laughs> Probably the electric company would like those. Alrighty. Like a third ish of the way to my goal. 
Max Ammers are going to be uh, precious here soon. Elemental Pop seems to be doing its job pretty well too. I can't see. Okay, zombies. Get a little crazy. Turn guys definitely uh, making quick work of them. I might have to actually. Oh, never mind. Thought I might have to grab the uh, swordfish off the wall, but I guess I won't have to now. Come on, give me my 50,000 points, game. I need to get out of this place. Oh, it's auto refilling max ammo too. Nice, nice. So I only have two of the shield parts too. I don't know if I really need the shield, honestly. If I can keep them off my back, like keep my back in a corner or against something, well, that'll. Be Come on, zombies, let's go. All the points time. Mag dump. I should have more than 28,000 points. Well, if he's like nerfed the uh, point, or what's going on with that, but I feel like I should have more points by now. Or I just need some double points. I can't see. Get out of my way, zombies! How do I get mule kick? Ooh. Actually comes in clutch because now I can buy that. Let's see how terrible it does. Or actually, no. Let's just go ahead and go back in. Uh, pack a punch. Pack a punch this. See how terrible it is after that. And then get the rest of my points. I know it's going to send me back another 5,000 points, but I mean, honestly, it means I don't have to worry about ammo, then what, what's it hurting, really? Do, 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 do. Okay, 60 and 600, that's pretty good. I'm not going to lie, that's pretty good for right off the wall there. Alright. Really? That didn't kill him. Oh, well, I guess it is round 25. <laughs> I'm not even paying attention to what round it is anymore. I'm just shooting and hoping I get enough points. Oh, run. Maybe this KN is just not very good or something. I don't know. Oh, no. It's auto burst. Not very ideal, honestly. Give me, give, give me in the invisibility field, please. Get 
Yeah, auto burst is not very good and it's not very powerful either. Oh, I can't see this hard one. That, that helps. That definitely helps. Death Machine of Doom. You know, speaking of not seeing things spawn lately, the, uh, the Napalm Zombie has refused to spawn, apparently. Where's the last zombie at? Come on, game. There we go. Okay, I don't have to worry about ammo. <laughs> I was about to buy some ammo, and I was like, yeah. Good thing I held off on it. Alright. Need a max ammo, game. There we go. Honestly, I probably should start off using this gun, because this gun's kind of wonky. That auto burst is not... I don't like auto burst weapons, they just seem pointless. Why Why would you have a burst fire when you could just have fully automatic? Especially if it's an auto burst, like it's just... Lazy man's full auto or something. Almost at 40,000. Four fifths of the way there. I know that kills off my points, but I perk. Rip. <laughs> Literally rip. <laughs> Alright. Kill you corner spawning zombies once and for all. Take those. Six thousand more points and then I can go unlock the ending. And I mean unlock the ending, not buy it yet. <laughs> Well, I mean, I guess I... Yeah, I'm not going to spoil it yet. Of course, this map's probably been out two weeks by the time you'll see this. Maybe longer, and obviously a lot of people probably already beat it, so... Am I really holding a spoiler back, or is it just me trying to be dramatic? Building suspense by withholding information that everybody knows. <laughs> Alright, zombies. So I just realized something. I lost my uh, effects. Like, there's no guns, smoke, or. Uh, I think the map's broken! That'd be alright. Ooh, infinite. How many left? Three? No turned! No! No! Oh, it don't matter. Alright, so the ending is... Let's see if I can get to it. Not jump down a hole. Oh gosh, that would have been really frustrating. So the ending is down here, but what happens is... Yep! Bad things. Lots of bad things. Luckily, I came prepared for this sort of a scenario. So yeah, the first time I did that to me, I'm like, oh crap, I'm going to die now. <laughs> but all I have to do is just get back to the ship, which if I... I think I'm going to do this. Yep. That's all I had to do. Oh, now it's dog ground. And then the ending was... Yeah, there you go. So, I'm not... Oh, never mind. Let's fight these guys real quick, and then I'll go end it. Why not? It's dog round. Shouldn't be that difficult. 
the napalm doucher over here. El tanky boy. Die! Yeah, I can't see his fire, by the way. That's, that's not good. Anyways, here is the ending. So, hopefully you all enjoyed this map. I mean, hopefully you enjoyed it more than I did. This dark, confusing maze of a mess. It was frustrating because it kept, like, having issues just trying to record it. So, anyways, thank you all for watching. And I will see you in the next one.